This is um, somewhat of a typical case. Um, you see a patient presenting with uh, seizures, and uh, if you compare, uh, we usually do think cuts through the hippocampal formation. Uh, we need to do flare and T2, and we can compare the hippocampus on the left compared to the right. You see here the right, the normal cortex is similar to the signal intensity in the rest of the cortex. On the other side, uh, on the left side, you see that it is thinned, it is hyper intense on flare, and you see uh, loss of volume. Sometimes we also find um, some dilatation of the temporal horn of the lateral ventricle, which is another secondary sign. Now, we also look at the fornix of the lateral ventricle. Sometimes we see thinning, uh, and here you can see that there is some asymmetric thinning of the fornix on the left compared to the right. Uh, mammary bodies sometimes they also show some asymmetric uh, atrophy. And in this case, you kind of see some flattening on the left compared to the right. So this is typical finding of measles temporal sclerosis, uh, classic case. Thank you.